There we go. Hot as an Osram forge, as Aaron would say. And stay there. I can just call you back when I'm ready for you anyway. Whoa, what the hell? Those flowers. The crown's wet too. The vein must have leaked here. Not enough to be the cause of the missing water, but enough for these plants to grow. We're on the right track. You see all that from a patch of wet sand? Yep. No running away. Not when these arrows don't cost any more than the other. Ooh, little dust storm, little cyclone. That's cool shit. What happens if I run into, run into, run into it? Run into this lightning cycle. Yeah. Oh, come here. Are you leaving me? Fine. It's kind of cool, like you. Oh. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, that's cool. Like the ground shakes and everything. Oh, he's actually like following me now. Like I, I got too close. I got too ambitious. Okay. I'm not here for them. Really didn't think that was a vulture. That's a crow, don't care. That man. It looks like the metal from the wound. You sure? We really are following its trail. As I've been saying, the desert kills, but it also surprises. You sure you can just uh, afford to hold off on it? There's a dam. Yeah. That goes past that ridge. We're gonna have to do some climbing. Nothing we can't handle, I'm sure. Oh! It's a lot of machines. Hi, guys. And a very dead soldier. Is it one of yours? I need to take a closer look. We need to get rid of the machines first. Before we need. Oh, I have a. Ooh! I have Wide Maul partially unlocked. Meaning, if I kill this guy and loot him just right, it would help. Tag the purge water stack. Tag the vacuum tube. Spikes now. That's explosive. Tag that bitch. Tag that bitch. Same thing. Ooh, acid canister. Okay. Mark that. Okay. Still love the fact that you can actually uh, tag uh, parts now. Is so nice. That should have been a thing in like the original too. Okay. <laughs> let's let's use the new shiny shit. What? God damn, dude. Like, even on base, like, these arrows do so much damage. <laughs> Suck it.
Why am I not sprinting? Hi. God damn it. Ah! Oh, did you hit him? Ooh, these guys use other extra ingredients, though. Okay, I can take that. Well, then by all means, my dude, stick around, enjoy the, enjoy the adventure tonight. How much of that stuff? Ooh, just six of them. I can literally just make like nine more arrows. Shit. I have to hope I got more of that stuff uh, back at home. Okay, let's switch back to the better hunter arrows. Um, these guys are. Oh, actually, on, I still have acid anywhere. I do. <laughs> Ooh. Like seriously, it doesn't take like anything to kill half these things now. Ooh, this is so much better. Well, what in God's name did you just do to the cramp? Is that like the focus killing stuff? Oh, it's gone anyway. I think that's the stuff that like kills the focus. Breaks the radar. Okay, that wasn't bad at all. Oh, so yeah, there's another wide mall though. I can't override that wide mall yet. I need more parts to fix the door. Good bud. Oh hi. Okay. Go over here. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh, oh, God, dude. Hey, this is still the basic hunter bow, like just a hunter bow. Like they, these guys are better, but they literally use, I think, just more material. Is what it's ten and five. Yeah, versus one and two, and they use like five times the resources, but they're still just basic resources. Yeah, that's not a bad deal at all. Oof, because it literally just uses shards and wood. I wonder if that might have actually at least helped us get. We got a storm? Like it's very spoopy looking out here. Don't see any. There we go. You know him. That. You can watch in style the now. Draka's men. I will cut off that dissident's head and feed it to the vultures if he had anything to do with. It. We don't know what happened here yet. Dude, that actually would be really fucked up if he was the one that like set it off. So that he had a way to challenge her, that would suck. Oh, See, same thing, I just healed like, like full health, like half my health. With like, one berry. Like, yeah, that's nice. Oof. Yeah, now I feel like this game might actually be a little more doable. Some of the challenges are still gonna blow, but... Okay, where's it go? Still got one. Water. Barely a lick's worth. But there are no streams in this area. Which means... These anchors. That soldier must have used them to get up this cliff. He must have been going back to Arrowhand when those machines got him. Maybe he found something up there worth reporting back about. We'll find out soon enough. Green shine. Is that a, is that a real one? Oh, it is. Yeah, it's a fragment. Hell yeah. I can't really tell the differences by looking at them. I haven't seen any of them. What is this? The problem. I'm gonna need my 
focus. He did. He did. He broke it. That's all bit. Weapon. Looks like Draka's man tried to pry this open, but he didn't know what he was doing. And now the water's not going uh, to be to. It wasn't necessarily on purpose. Sabotage. Or ignorance. Yeah, as I say, it's like. This is gonna do anything. This must be the pipe that connects to Scalding Spear. But it also keeps Maybe going. If I follow that main pipe. I'll find something yep. useful. Oh, okay, no, I see. What do you need me to do? Just uh, stay here. Let me know if anything changes. I'm gonna take a look around. A valve. That might help. Leaking. It looks like that stopped the water flow. Now I just need to find a way to get it to Scalding Spear. Ooh, what's in here that's fucking weren't? No, just more money. Uh, I was kind of hoping it would actually be something legit, but I guess it's just both safe for not. That's the same type of machinery we found outside. Only well, this one's not leaking. Maybe. Can help me switch the water flow. Well, stop talking and let me pull it. Find out. It sounds like the water's switched. Gotta open the valve upstairs. Get that water circuit. Ah! I'm not getting up through there. Hey. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh, if I gotta go like all the way around, that's dumb. The system switched back. Couldn't hold the water pressure. I need to find a way up to that valve. Oh, yeah, okay, yeah, so we gotta be ready to go. It sounds like the water's switched. Gotta open the valve upstairs. Get that water circulating. Oh shit, I just now noticed it. Yep. Damn it. If I'd noticed that earlier. There. I bet I can use that. Alright, gonna wait. It'll reset here in a second. Cool. Yep. Right out of time. I need to hit the switch again and try to reach that valve upstairs right after. Gotta open the valve upstairs. Get that water circulating. <laughs> Sounds like that did something. Aloy, I can hear water in the room again. Anything leaking? Not that I can see. Let's hope that means my plan worked. I was like, where is she at? I forget this stupid game likes to just keep track of whatever quest I had selected, not what quest I'm doing. 
Yeah, it's marking me to go find side. I was supposed to talk to her and really standing right there. Do it. This will return water to Scolding Spear. Checking the wound is the only way to be sure. Draka knew what would happen if the capital was left without water, but he didn't care. All he wanted was to cause a crisis so he could challenge my command. We don't know that for sure. I do believe that, Meet me but back it's at the right. When you can. Please, to make sure the water will flow. I will. Don't do anything rash about Draka. Only an upstart acts rashly. A commander bides her time. Then kills the fool. Hey. The desert was kind to lead you to us. Very right, cool. Thanks I'm actually glad I came and did this. Draka and Yara. This was actually kind of a neat story. I've actually really enjoyed a lot of the side quests for this, uh, this one. Oh, no. ah. That is a Chuck Walla. Then, like, Chuck Test. And I got nothing of importance. Enough of an incline to give me a little, a little leap. Sorry, bro. I need your guts. And yours, too. Okay, well, now that I know I need lots of material, uh, go ahead. Try to grab all. Takes like five of those to make those errors. Oh, was this the settlement I didn't get to find? Yeah, I think so. I noticed there was like a settlement on my way up there. Oh my god. That is kind of funny. If what Jataka says is true, Yara and Draka will end up killing a lot more than just each other. Even it's funnier if I'd actually thought about it first and been like, <gasps> What? Why would you spoil it for me? Well, Liberty Gibbet. Where the freak entrance? Oh, the other entrance. By the exit. Like, where did we come out from? There we go. Here. Welcome. Maybe I should grab this other quest before somebody's dead. There we Way up there. Ooh, you make dies. One's actually cool. Yep, 
Yeah, see, I don't like the Dora one. Those are actually cool. Return again, and we will trade. Oh. Oh. Okay. Oh. Oh. The hell in the ever loving hell do I get up there? See, I've still only ever played Asylum and didn't even beat it. You wanted to speak to me? The name's Zoka. Have you heard from up north? From Bleeding Mark? I'm guessing that's a place. <laughs> One of the desert's villages. They send their yield of ash blood so the Bereka over there can mark the skin of our soldiers. But it's been a long time since the last supply run. Too long. If you think something happened to them, can't you send someone to go check? Were it up to me. But with everyone fuming about our water rations, the commander can't spare any soldiers. You mentioned the village up north sends some supplies to the capital. Ashblood? It's a crimson stone that we grind into powder for our ink. Bleeding Mark has the largest supply. Our soldiers there gather and deliver it to us in exchange for their water rations. <laughs> Die for water. Everyone in the clan depends on the wound in the sand for their water. Capital and outlying village alike. But the last delivery of ash blood was weeks ago. Our supply is running low. So must be their water. My face paint will strike fear in your enemies. Take a look. Can I finally put on fucking face paint? Oh. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Okay. I mean, I almost feel like I should just do that on the principle for wearing the Utaru outfit. 100%. Origins of Middle School because I got it for Christmas. I got it for like three weeks. And that was all I played. Nice. Yeah, like, I, I don't mind them. Like, don't get me wrong. It's not like I didn't enjoy it. I remember playing Asylum when it first came out. And I didn't, in, I didn't finish it. And I don't really remember why. Like, I wasn't that far off the end either. Uh, I, just, I didn't keep going with it. I think I got too hung up on, like, riddles. Like, trying to find, like, the little, like, riddler trophies. So I just kind of got annoyed. Rather than pushing forward. But they do look good, though. Like, I mean, I, I wanted to eventually go back to them. Oh, I... Nice. Do the desert paint. This is actually kind of cool. My problem is I still like Aloy for Aloy to where I don't really know if I want to do one. But the fact that I now can is kind of cool. Yeah, screw it. Nice. If I'm out that way, I can look in on the village, find out what's the delay. Oh, I dude, I love the scarecrow bits. Head yes. To a ruin where the desert meets the mountain. I did enjoy those. That's bleeding mark. Ask for Kentok or Natika there. They'll know what's going on. The deluge. Okay, now... Oh, that's cool. Getting old school tattoos done. Okay. First pick up. Oh. 
Okay. Yeah, where it's like you can just put whatever you want, but yeah, since I was wearing it, I was like, well, she's already got the marks in her arms just because of the armor. I was like, yeah, might as well actually give her the face paint too. Match it up. I see soldiers guarding the wound in the sand. But no Yara. What's going on? It does look like it's more full though. At least I think. I need to see the wound. I'm afraid your presence is required in the commander's quarters. Is everything okay? There's a reason it's not <laughs> in a technicality. The wound. How did he interfere? He entered the wound by force, saw that it was empty, except for a slow trickle that began when you fixed the device in the desert. He did not take it well. Of course he didn't. I'll go meet with them. You do get it fairly early on, though, in this one. Your trade is welcome. I was about to say, it's like, is there a way up here? Oh, oh that's not. You have okay. Some nerve. You want to talk? Does sound good? Isn't this? Why is like the one place that doesn't have like a grapple thing? I can't believe. Agree. I can't believe you either. How the fuck do I get up here? I kind of hate this place. Design-wise, this is kind of cool, but layout-wise, I do not like this uh, settlement. I'll see now this game like by the way whoop up right there how could you let this happen how did i let this happen you're the one who sabotaged the wound in the first place you're lucky we were able to fix it or your head would already be on a spear you call that fixed it's just a dribble and it's not my fault i already told you ukta came to me he said he found something in the desert that might get us water. I had no idea it had anything to do with the wound. And you expect me to believe that? Aloy, I came for the water that was owed to us. And when I found out that there is no water, they arrested me. As I already told you, the water is returning, but slowly. It'll be weeks before the wound is full again. I mean, like it's it normal, apparently. It refills itself in time. Can. You hid what happened to the wound. How can we believe you now? Draka. No, you know what? Enough of this. No more words. Consider that a challenge. Gather your squads then and meet us at the gate of the vanquished. I have a challenge to prepare for. Leave me. Yep. This will be the end of the clan. This is pretty exciting for a side story. I have to stop it. Indeed. We have to stop it. Hold on a second. Help me understand. What do you mean, the end of the clan? Both sides will take their most loyal squads to the Gate of the Vanquished. Then they'll butcher each other as part of a ritual challenge. But it won't stop there. Whoever wins will try to wipe out the loser's loyalists all over the desert. The fighting could last for months. Those two scabheads are going to doom us all. Can't you stop them? I'm a chaplain. I provide counsel. I cannot force them to heed it. Even Chief Akaro can't intervene. It is a matter for the clan alone. All right, ma'am. If I'm still here, cool. If not, you have a good night to my man, and I'll see you tomorrow. I should still be here, though. I got a little while longer. What is this gate? The doorway to a dead cauldron. Ah. A symbol of what the tribe aspires to. That's where we're going. Defeat of deranged machines. Dead. What shut it off? No one knows. But why do they know a it's a cauldron? Great significance for our clan. Even greater now since it will mark the onslaught of a massacre. 
I wonder if that's a fuck up from Gorilla. Because why do they call it a cauldron? Actually, come to think of it, I think even the Norris said it first, too. Okay, yeah, maybe maybe the Noras were the ones that called them cauldrons, too. I thought those were like the official name. What makes you think I can help you stop them? I'm not even from this tribe. They both owe you a debt. You aided them when no one else could. And you've seen into their hearts, just like I have. Misguided in different ways, but no less worthy of the people they protect. Your words might be enough to spear some sense into them. Yeah, well, they're not exactly good listeners. And you are no ordinary speaker. <laughs> you took down the ah. unyielding bulwark, <laughs> fought off an assault of Regala's machines. I will go to the gate of the vanquished, southwest of here, to stall them. But without you, I'm afraid we'll run out of body bags fast. They'll actually have body bags? Well, they're very futuristic, apparently, all of a sudden. But okay, cool. Nice to see we actually did find the purpose behind that cauldron we were just at already. Shav? Yep, cool. More for Shav stuff. Desert capital is an intimidating place. It houses the imposing tower from which the settlement gets its name, surrounded by a field of strange mirrored plates that resembles a graveyard. From within, the rigid Commander Yara rules the clan with cold steel. Residents hardened by perpetual conflict in the harsh environment fear none, or so I thought. Came here to resolve a conflict over the rights to a tattoo. A minor squabble, squabble in the eyes of Harja, but a matter of life and death for the Tana. Having bled to earn a few of them myself on the field of battle, I feared that neither party would willingly relinquish their claim. So you can imagine my surprise when upon arrival I witnessed the two warriors in question coming to a swift agreement. As they saluted each other, a small company broke away from the gathered crowd toward us, another marshal and her escort. On seeing me, ooh, Marshal Regala, okay. Stopped and we stood shoulder to shoulder. When we last met, she had looked down on me with utter disgust during the cold route that made me marshal. Now, in a moment of tense quiet, she stared at me, her eyes still ablaze with unspeakable malice. Finally, she set off. Only then did I notice our respective escorts releasing their grip on their weapon killed. Afterwards, I learned that Regala has her own way of dealing with disputes. On her arrival, the claimants get one singular chance to come to an agreement. If that attempt bears no fruit, well, suffice it to say that, mere, that merely mentioning her involvement is often enough to resolve most claims. In her, I have an implacable enemy. Because I am Karja, her revulsion will never abate. I fear that one day we will face each other in a duel that only one can survive. Well, so be it. Back home, they named me Unyielding Shaw for a reason. It's kind of cool. So I guess we will maybe find some more Fashav things, because, like, he still went all over the region before everything went to hell, so. Point over here. Now I have to leave one. Now I want to know, like, how far I can glide from here. <laughs> Shit. Oh, I do want to... A rush of air. Commander asked not to be disturbed as she prepares for battle. Here are 
Where's the armor vendor? I don't think I ever did. Oh. Oh no, yeah, yeah, I did talk. I don't know why he still had like an exclamation thing. He suddenly owned something new. Oh, yeah. Is there a camp close by? Yes, there is. 40 points for finding out finally that I can quick travel for free. That makes life a lot easier. And it makes me feel a lot better about doing it. Because I'm pretty sure I've done significantly less. Um fast travel than I ever have like or I ever did I should say playing the first game hey pop this wonderful allergy pill real quick guys because if I don't I will never be able to breathe especially what with the weather changing again Everything getting warmer all of a sudden. 